Hi there. I'm John Smith from the John Smith Real Estate Group, and this morning's topic is the Northwest Lancaster County Bike Trail. Hi, I'm John Smith from the John Smith Real Estate Group, and today we're going to be exploring a great trail here in Lancaster County. It's called the Northwest Lancaster County River Trail. It goes approximately 13 miles from the village of Falmouth down to Columbia along the Susquehanna River. So let's go along for the tour and we're going to tour most of the 13 miles and as we go along we're going to look at the different sites. So thanks so much for tuning in and here we go. If you're looking to buy a home click on our buying link on our website. If you're looking to sell a home click on the selling link. Now back to our topic. Here we are at a prominent quarry that was operated in 1847 by John Haldeman. Rich in limestone, the Lower Susquehanna River Valley was a host to a number of proper, profitable quarry operations throughout the years. Beginning in 1847, it had four lime kilns and produced agricultural lime for fertilizer as well as lime for whitewashing and plaster. As the steel industry grew, however, so did the need for the dol dolomite, which was mined from the quarry and used to extract impurities from steel during the smelting. As a result, the quarry operations grew significantly in the early 1900s and through World War I. And now let's take a look at the actual quarry where they qu quarried the limestone along the river. Okay, here we are at the limestone quarry and you can see the beautiful views here of the Susquehanna River. And uh, it's just a great place to have a picnic lunch. And as you pan around, you can see the outcroppings of the limestone. Very, very uh, uh, beautiful. And uh, they almost look like the salt mines, but it is limestone and again, quarried back in the early 1800s. Okay, here we are at another stop along the way. Uh, this is a spot where we, you can uh, view bald eagles. Uh, bald eagles are very popular here along the Susquehanna as there's plenty of fish and other uh, uh, food for them to eat. Uh, the bald eagle has been our symbol for over 200 years. And uh, we were here about a month ago and we actually saw two bald eagles in their nest and the nesting spot is right behind us. There's actually two nests up there in the sycamore trees. So again, if you're coming down here to the trail, this is a great spot to, uh, to check out the bald eagles. Here's one of our favorite spots along the trail. It uh, is the bridge that is, spans the Susquehanna from the eastern shore to the western shore. It was an old railroad bridge and they transported materials like coal and other things from the eastern shore of the Susquehanna over to the western shore. And if you can see the fishermen are out there uh, in the river. Uh, many species of fish are in here from walleye to bass to muskie. And uh, it's just a great, great place for other outdoor sports as well as kayaking, canoeing. Okay, here we are at the Marietta Point where you can get on the trail. Um, as you can see in the background, there was a boat ramp where you can put in your, your motorboat or canoe or kayak. And as you pan around, you can see just a beautiful view again of the Susquehanna. And uh, down here in Marietta, they have a beautiful pavilion. I would guess it seats probably about 100 to 150 people. And uh, just a great place to have a picnic, a family reunion. Okay, that's going to do it for our tour this morning of the Northwest River Trail in Lancaster County. Um, we hope you enjoyed the, the scenic tour and just a few tidbits about the history here. It's just a beautiful part of Lancaster County. And uh, on behalf of my team, we thank you for tuning in. And remember, we're anxious to help you with your real estate needs. Thanks so much and have a great fall.